Hi guys, here we've got a rock band wireless Fender uh, electric guitar for uh, PlayStation. Uh, the button, this button here, the red button seems to be sticking only during gameplay. So I'm going to have a look at that today. Just give you a close up of the label on the back. And um, it's a Fender Jaguar um, electric guitar. So, um, first thing, here close up. I'm going to pop these two buttons off. This red button is the one that's playing up. I'm going to pop that off because there's a screw behind it. And I can pop this orange button off as well because there's two screws. And I'll just show you here. There's a screw there and two screws here, which need to be undone. And then once they're undone, there's uh, four screws up here, which need to be undone. One screw here, and then if you fold the guitar back, there's four screws on the here, which also need to be removed. And once they're removed, there's a couple of screws inside here with the metal plate, which also need to remove be removed, I didn't actually film it. And the problem is with this main brain, I'll just show you here, I'm just using some platen cleaner. Just pour it on there and just use this cotton bud. And let's get it in between the main membrane here. This is the contact for the buttons, plastic membrane. Just gotta clean the contacts inside, as you can see here. Give you a close up there. Still shot there. There's two layers. You got to get in between it and clean the contacts. With non-harsh cleaners. Like I said, I'm using platinum, and then uh, I used to use a bit of tissue just to dry it off. Give it a cleaning fluid, and now that that's done, I'll put the guitar back together. Just give you a close up how you put the buttons together. Uh, when it pops off, this metal part the spring might pop off also. This clips into the button. There's a hinge on the one side. And you just got to clip it in. And you heard that click in there. And you heard that side click in there. I'll show you here, it's on the hinge, like so. And then once you've got that clicked into there, you're just gonna slot it in. There's a slot inside the housing. Just give you a little close up. There's a slot there which the clip slides under. But first, I'm going to put a bit of grease around it. There seems to be a lot of grease inside these things when you pull them apart. And I'll just show you what kind of grease I'm using here. It's just normal silicon grease. So, it's just a matter of sliding the tab in on the little plastic part there. And then you just got to line up with a little clip. Just press it down, and that's it. That's that's the uh, button in place. I'll just give it a try here. You see, it's bouncing up and down, so that seems to work in fine. And that pretty much concludes. So, thanks for watching, and uh, please subscribe.